in CVs and cover letters, what are AJ Engineering looking for? It, to us it's very important that you write your own CV. Take the time and effort to write that. Um, don't worry about so, do you know so much about the grammar? That's, that's not a critical thing. It's taking the time to sit down and think, right, what skills, what can I offer this company? Because if you don't know what you can offer, how would anybody else? So, so sit down and think, right, what does this company do that I'm interested in? What are they looking for? So, as per any CV, start off with a description of your, yourself, of what, you're, what you'd like to do and why you're applying list your academic grades, but equally important, perhaps even more important, is list what you do outside school that might have an, a, 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 an importance. So that could be, let's say, if you're in the Boy Scouts, the Girl Guides, you might not think that's relevant, but to us it shows a commitment to something. It shows that you make an effort and you, that you go along and you help and you, you take part in these things. Um, and that says something to us about your commitment to things and, and we take that as a, if they've committed to that then they're going to be committed to anything else that they take on, for instance, a job. Um, if you do anything practical that you think might be relevant, like I say, that, that could be anything. Uh, whether, whether, like I say, you like to repair bikes, you like to um, help somebody who has a, a practical job you've got a paper bound, you, uh, what else could it possibly be? Is there anything outside, outside school that sets you apart from others? At the end of the day, that's the important thing with CV, is how it shows you as being different from the rest, what sets you out um, from others. And that could be things like voluntary work as well, it's very important if you can demonstrate that you've helped out for a number of hours a week or for a week during the holidays doing something where you weren't paid for. That again shows a commitment and a willingness to do these kind of things. And that means a lot to an employer, not, not just AG Engineering but any employer. Um, so yes, CV, very important, write it yourself and also a covering letter. Doesn't, a covering letter doesn't have to be long, paragraph or two just explaining why you're submitting that CV. Again, when we talked about, when I mentioned commitment there, it shows that you are serious enough about this application, you've taken the time to write a letter. When we just get um, standard CVs that are in no way uh, specific to age engineering, it, it, to us it says they've taken, the amount of effort they've taken is pressing print on, uh, on the computer um, because the same CV is going to have but if there's a covering letter and the CV's a bit more bespoke, then it shows you've taken the time and you are genuinely interested in AG Engineering. Because why should AG Engineering be interested in you if you, if you don't demonstrate you're interested in AG Engineering?